Hello everyone and welcome back to the SCG Game Night here at Grey Ogre Games. It's round 3. My name is Mick. I'm one of your hosts alongside Truth or Dare. Mr. Jeffrey Chan. I want to do the... Um, last week, Cass and I were doing the uh, over-enthusiastic DJ voices. Hello, welcome to the... Because you, when you do oh, like, the radio voice, you hyper, yeah. invert your voice. <laughs> make it sound like this. So that everything sounds so good. It's not like the um, movie, those narrator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's what they do. They, yeah. they, <laughs> when you're supposed to exhale, you inhale. When you're supposed to inhale, you exhale. <laughs> stuff. It, it's a really weird technique. But uh, yeah, it kind of makes everything sound like Mr. X. Uh, oh my god, I can't do that. Do it like Morgan Freeman. Okay. <laughs> no, Morgan Freeman has a very different timbre to his voice. <laughs> Morgan, uh, yeah, Morgan Freeman just has a... a a very nice sounding voice, very smooth, you know. The tempo right. of his voice yeah. is very different. So true, yeah. true, true. Uh, anyway, <laughs> we're watching the <laughs> I game don't think I can ever do that. <laughs> <laughs> watching a game between uh, Risaldo and Joshin. Risaldo is running, I believe, uh, Ban Coco. And uh, Joshin, I'm uh, not quite sure. Well, Risaldo told me the last time we played, he was uh, he was playing Ban, Ban Coco and was telling himself like okay if we don't do well today we will you know I, I will scrap this deck and play another deck uh, he went to the finals of um, of the games day oh uh, okay lost I, I won uh, but <laughs> said, yeah I'm, I'm gonna give this deck another try <laughs> so, um, yeah. yeah a lot of people sort of like lost confidence in Ban Coco because it's good yeah like, I mean it's, it's good it's just that everybody was prepared for it then yeah. I mean yeah you had to read Coco into good stuff or draw into good stuff right now win, it's, yeah. it, it feels like it's uh, scissors paper stone uh, true, true. sorry we go back to rock paper scissors yeah, because uh, Ban Coco has a very favourable matchup against um, the machine gun decks Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. A relatively favorable. Yeah, uh, it's yeah. more to their favor. They can still lose if you have a bad hand. Mm -hmm. Uh, but the machine, uh, but dies immediately to demerge decks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The demerge deck is just too fast. Yeah. The quasi like return decks, yeah. Mm. And uh, then, um, but those decks die to the uh, to machine, the machine gun, gun decks. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. We're, we're in that. Very weird, like rock paper scissors. Yeah. Like, it depends on what your yeah. meta game. Yeah, bang coco. Match up is like almost fifty percent across the board. Yeah, you, you need to draw. You need draw against some okay. deck. You need to draw like v a very good curve. You can't just like spell quarter quarter company then just try to yeah, run yeah, off. Exactly. Uh. Like you, you, you need to like pre proactive. Yeah. Uh, you yeah. Yeah, yeah that's the word. Yeah, proactive. You the, need the, yeah, proactive yeah. Yeah. Even like against the Winnie deck, you, you can't afford to like keep like spell quarter hand because they don't exactly. really do much. So you know just. It's yeah, a, yeah, I guess it's a meta. Now it becomes a meta game call. Previously, mm, the deck true, was true. just powerful on its yeah, own, it's powerful despite own, yeah. uh, who you're playing against. Maybe the, the one of the weaker matchups was against like blue mono blue prison. Uh, that was hard. That yeah. was hard, but not impossible. True, true. Um, but yeah, now nowadays it's it's all a uh, you know de depending on the meta game. Until yeah. somebody invents like a really weird wacky yeah. new deck. Chin now. Most you of the meta game, total, yeah, right? most most of the decks are about how familiar with your own deck. You yeah. basically basically you not know what you are supposed to do with your deck and inter interact with your opponent and stop his game plan. That's all. Mm. Most of the deck are quite similar in this style of perspective. And uh, yeah. we're gonna start off with uh, Joshin casting. So Joshin is, I think, black white. Yeah, black control. Aldrazi or black white control, and uh, yeah, we have the uh, what you call it. Uh, transgress the mind. Yeah. Let's see what he takes. I think you take the spell queller. Yeah, def. I think spell, spell queller. Yeah, good. probably spell queller. Is it best. Remove this. Well, there's two copy of spell queller, so yeah. Yeah, just take one. It's fine. Yeah. Like you His just hand, want to resolve some yeah, spells. Yeah, with hand is pretty stacked. Ooh. Ooh. Take it off. It's satisfying. Uh, yeah, the sound. Of yeah, you guys. Yeah. Stuff like rapper rap. I don't know what they call these stuff. Stickers. Stickers. Stick, 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 stickers. Yeah, yeah same feeling. Same feeling as popping a... What is it called? Uh, the... the uh, what is it? Something? Bubble wrap. Bubble, bubble wrap. wrap. Yeah, bubble yeah. wrap. <laughs> oh, yeah, but I left so many stains on it. We were not talking about the game at all. <laughs> <laughs> this is bad. Yeah, yeah, this is bad control. Ah, yeah, uh, read the bone. Read the bone. Being cast. Yeah. 
this this I mean Risaldo is plays very uh, slow and Joshin is taking advantage of it. Yeah. yeah, I mean if the turn four turn, turn four Gideon come to play, land, yeah. You know. Turn two you had an untapped land and then you'd you'd have um what's the name? Lamhot Pacifist. Yeah, or even Silver Advocate. Dust, yeah, yeah that's what we could do. Even Silver Advocate, yeah, it would, yeah. would have been a lot faster play, but unfortunately, Rizaldo here being very light on lands. And, yeah, uh, you know, uh, he has a land. land. That'll be good. No, yes. It's a tap land, but that's fine. That's okay. Yeah. You can cast it's your two drops right now. Yeah, at least you can stay establishing a board. Yeah, it's a good tap land anyway because it's produced white. And I like that he cast the uh, Dustwatch Recruiter first because uh, if. He's able to flip the Dust Watch Recruiter if Joshin doesn't have anything to play, which it looks like he doesn't. Yeah, uh, I, he'll I, be able to flip it. you know flip it and cast multiple spells next turn. Uh, he's he's got at least two green sources, but no, there's going to be an ultimate price. It dies. Bye bye. Yeah, but with Risaldo hand, a lot of his two drop died to ultimate price. Already. So yeah, you don't mind using so. the Dust Watch Recruiter has a bit. It doesn't have that much staying power as well. But yeah. I do prefer Dash Wars Recruiter though. I I uh, true, but then yeah, it I think Risaldo hand is stank enough such that he don't really have It doesn't really matter, uh, right? Uh, yeah, it doesn't really matter. He don't really have a lot of time to activate. He's looking for the clue token, but there's Imaku clue token there. <laughs> it's right there, man. It's yeah. like that white uh, color thing on the side. But he want to use the authentic, the authentic one. one. Yeah. Come on, yes. man. Yes. We designed the Emerald clue <laughs> token. They look nice. They look I have nice. yet to even use a single clue token yet. <laughs> <laughs> coming soon. Coming soon. Coming soon. Coming soon. Uh, so yeah, another ultimate prize. Going to take care of the... Uh, Tyler Tracker. Tyler Tracker would have been good if it stuck on the board, unfortunately. But it did yeah. it did his job, able to get the uh, the clue. Uh, the clue. Yeah. So now you can actually cast two spells, but I don't recommend that because uh, uh, it might get blown out by language. Yeah, I believe the last creature to for Risado to cast would be the Seven You want yeah. to achieve. The uh, six plus land, four, yeah. plus four, yeah. first, right? plus okay, two, plus yeah. two bonus. I agree with the drawing, drawing of the card first, and uh, yeah, just drop. Uh, you know, I think you should be dropping threats at this point. Like, just keep yeah. every turn, just slowly drop yeah. threats. Yeah, get and get stuff onto the board first, and use spell color to buy some uh tempo. Mm. Anyway, uh, when you even casting the reflector mage does something though. Yeah, yeah, but you cast yeah. the reflector mage. I think that makes more efficient use of mana. Uh, does not die to let's say ultimate yeah. price right now. Yeah, Phantom Mage can at least attack. The whole specifics require uh, uh, Joshin to yeah. not do anything in, in order to flip. Oh, damn. Okay, so oh. he just passes the turn. Um, uh, now that Joshin has Sorin, obviously Sorin will work wonder now. But Sorin is going to be mad. I mean, like. Yeah, but then yeah, you know, even if you saw in, you still survive. You plus, right? you still survive the attack. Goes to seven. Uh, it will go to five. Yeah. Yep. Okay, but uh, shambling vents here are gonna hit, and um, that's fine. Yeah. I think he should have blocked. Like, just cast the spell color. Well, if you d that's uh, the thing. Like, if you yeah. weren't doing anything, you could have cast something last. Yeah, time. I think uh, casting a spell color is much more effective play for Risaldo because mm. you don't really need the spell card to eat any more spell from Joshin because Joshin does not have anything to play. Yeah. I think his hand Joshin's hand is a uh, Crops of Darkness and a land I think. Uh, it's got a language in it though. So maybe oh. you want to save it for the language. Uh, if Joshin doesn't have another play then um, you know it's going to be hard times man. Hard hard times. Yeah but uh, Joshin language, like I don't think you can catch many creatures. Yeah. Considering uh, that Joshin don't really have many plays to make anyway, and Risado isn't primed to make any more commitment to the board. Uh, Joshin yeah. here trying to bait out yeah, we, a uh, spell queller, but yeah. of course that's not going to work. Yeah. It's not going to work on me, man. Joshin really require need to draw at least a Prince Walker to start pressuring Risado yeah. much more. Just quick, running out his yeah, creature much to quicker, attack yeah, more is quickly not a good idea. Because, yeah. He's always just taking his time to establish his power. Then uh, probably next turn, casting the Sivan Vukit as a 4-6. Then using spell color, have an effective blocker. Ah, uh, effective. Ooh. Andrea, you need more Emra Clue tokens. Haven't you gotten enough? We got one whole stack of Emra Clue tokens that time. 
Just one box full of it. <laughs> yeah, I I I suspected they they were giving it out during the GPs, right? Portland, yeah, yeah. GP Portland. Yeah. So I don't, but I don't think we have given out like all of them. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. Uh, but yeah, nice Liliana and wow. uh, Wolf of Liliana. Pretty good, actually. This place is insane. Yeah. Liana get taken out by Spellcrawler and then cast Oath of Liana, returning the Liana back <laughs> to the battlefield, triggering the Oath of Liana again, so putting a 2-2 cool. zombie. Mmm, dark. Uh, so, yeah. The value. The value. The value. Yeah. Speaking about clock, yeah, Liana is a very promising clock that requires a... Oh, Andrea, yeah. you didn't get them in... in GP Portland. Oh, you could just mm. ask Ben for them. Yeah, I remember passing it to yeah. Joe. Yes, we just asked it for them. Like they will give it to you for free. The instructions yeah. were to give it out for free. Yeah, they probably have it, but they just yeah nobody asked for it, so they probably didn't remember yeah, about just it. Put it out there. It's like toss it on the table, <laughs> leave it on the floor. I mean, well. their table space is limited. <laughs> yeah. There's a true, lot. Yeah. yeah, I mean, if you put one box there, it probably will go missing probably soon. <laughs> <laughs> like, where's the box? No, 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 no. Oh man, and language there gonna wipe out uh Rizaldo's board. Yeah. Even the um. The Even the same advocate, advocate. Yeah, yeah die Just from the Liana minus. The Liliana. Minus two, uh, minus one. This is gonna be a bit tough. Uh, Risaldo does have the uh, what you call it, uh, the lumbering falls, but yeah. he's not attacking with it. I got a very strong a feeling that Risaldo has collected company in his hand. Yeah, no kidding. Mm. Uh, I wonder what that could be. Mm, could be another spell called company. Oh, okay, it's company. So collected company. Collected company. Are we going to see a spell queller of the collected company? Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, the odds is about 2 to about 45 cards. So yeah, it's not really about optimistic. 1 in 20. 20 so about 5% cards, chance. Yeah. Uh, one, one, no, five. no, but you have 6 cards. Yeah, so it's oh, about... But we do see a spell queller. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah we got it. And uh, Tyler Tracker, which yeah. is actually a very good card. Yeah. Uh, but the spell caller, I think, going to die very soon because uh, Joshin just has uh, like umpteen removal in hand. Yeah, but Joshin only have one card in hand, so oh. that card have to be a removal. If, if this is an ultimate price, this will be very awkward. I think it's an ultimate price, right? No, it's not an ultimate price. If he if he is, he will not take up on the tracker. He will definitely take up the tracker with ultimate price and take up on the oh, okay, spell the, uh, caller. Spell caller. Right, that's true. Alright, so he doesn't have um doesn't look like he has a removal for the spell queller. Yeah. Uh, hmm. So how come there's a No, there? he's oh, talking yeah, about the minus one minus oh, okay, minus okay. two a bit. Right. Minus two minus, minus, two, minus one. one a bit. So it becomes a one one uh, dude Yeah okay. I think Risaldo has a Dromoka command In his hand Which is Make it a plus one plus one Yeah Probably Plus one plus one The spell queller No No the spell queller does something I'll probably put on a tracker though mm. Yeah I mean if the spell queller Were to die It can die easily uh, Yeah it gets Joshin To sacrifice the Enchantment Yeah uh, Very interesting Like you, you don't think That uh, Oath of Liliana does much but it actually does quite a lot because uh, yeah. it gets you blockers at the end yeah. of uh, if the spell card were to die it will trigger the Oath of Liliana again wow oh, mean that Tamiyo Tamiyo what oh, man this Tamiyo yeah, is going to run off yeah I remember uh, Rizaldo saying that you know he, he bots in the Tamiyo more often than not so he just put it, puts yeah, it in the main yeah. board like, he puts I think two in the main board right now mm-hmm. uh, with more on the side board Wow, oh, very powerful card. And yeah. you're going to swing him for three points of damage against yeah. Liliana. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, you don't get to draw two cards, do you? Do you combat damage to a player? Let me check. Uh, let's see. No, it's do combat damage, right? Oh, do combat damage. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's see. Tamio Fuel Researcher. Choose up to two target yeah, creatures. Yeah, do combat damage. Yeah, when they do combat damage, you draw a card. Mm, so very much good. value. Very nice. Yeah. Speaking of which, I recently... Saw a Ban Super Friend deck on Modo. Yeah, he plays Tamio, Jace, Naset, <laughs> the big Gideon Jace, uh, is the yeah the big Jace, not the small. And then plays uh deploy gate watch. No, no, he play off of the off of Nisa. Then he plays, I think just only Nisa and board wipes, and some com- some form of 
How about Lies. Oath of Gideon? Cut your no 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 Oath of Gideon. No, no Oath of Gideon. Oath of Gideon gets you. Yeah, it's, it man. plays like a green white token with the blue for the others. The the bun prince walker. Does it play um hangback walker? Yes. Oh man, okay. Yeah. Legit, legit. Walker. Yeah. And I got ulti twice by two different ring walker with the demonic against the demonic pack but I managed to win. <laughs> the the Tamiya ulti Tamiya ulti twice. Uh, no Tamiya ulti once and I believe the Liliana also the this one Liliana. Oh right right. Uh, and yeah. I believe Jace. the Nisa also ulti. The one that gains you life and then Yeah I draw, oh, but I draw all you have to do is just de- uh, pro, uh you know to pass the Hanan Soccer. Yeah, pass yeah. the uh, yeah. demonic pack. Surprisingly, right? yeah, there are a lot of plane soccer that are quite pressuring. I mean, Naset being so high already, and if it's ulti, you cannot even play non creature spell. Yeah, it's yeah. not a good idea, man. And just mm-hmm. with the, uh, what's it called? The Irayo mechanic. Uh, the, you cannot you cast, can, you, you cast uh, what, your first spell. Cast first spell, get counter. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that card is pretty frustrating. That's actually very good. Yeah. But Tamiyo ulti is quite, quite potent. Since Tamiyo's fan, ulti yeah. is crazy. You got yeah. Omniscience. Yeah, draw three cards. Ancestral Recall plus Omniscience. <laughs> Alright. Uh, getting himself a yeah. clue token there. Can make the Tyler's Tracker a 3. No, yeah. can make it a 4-4. Four, four, sorry. But, uh, yeah, I believe Risado has a Reflector Mage in his hand. So, the... The Gideon, the night token is gonna be sent away probably soon, and the Tash Tracker is now a. Now it's a three three. Yeah, it's two counter. Now it's a three three. Could so be a four, yeah, four could be a like four that four, too. and that will take out either Liana or the Gideon. Okay, so instead going to try draw off draw more cards. Reflect the mage. Okay, that was weird. Yeah. I mean, if you were to use the Tamiyo, yeah, 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 I will the activate mage, the will. Lumbering 4 and plus the ability on both Lumbering 4 and the... Uh, oh, yeah, then you can uh, take out... And the uh, Nasa. Like oh, no, no, you have to crack the crew token to kill the Gideon. Yeah. yeah, so you can't really activate with the... So I think you hit the Gideon here. I think the Gideon's more important because the Gideon makes blockers. Yeah, Even true. more blockers than usual, so... I think you should be hitting the Gideon. But he, he has a blocker though. He has got the uh um, van. Shambling van, so oh. Alright, but let's uh, see Liana. Yeah, he okay, took out the out Liana something. instead. That's it, soak up all the Yeah, time. but Joshim really doesn't have anything much. Now he need to draw Language. Yeah. Because language yeah, language, kill? yeah, language will, will wipe out the board. Uh no. No, 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 the, the Tyre Tracker will, yeah. will, will survive the language. Uh, so he needs... He needs... Uh, descend upon the sim. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I was thinking about. Like, descend or maybe just, you know... Uh, Sorry? Banner Outburst. Banner Outburst. Yeah, Banner Outburst will, will be fantastic. Sorry, actually. Sorry will be good too. Yeah, but uh, Sorry also will die to... No, you trade the off bot. with the... um With the Tracker. Tamiyo. Yeah, Tamiyo. Then you can't... The, the Tash Tracker and the rest will probably finish you off too. That's true. You're only at 9 life. Yeah. That's, that's a good point. Um, and the recruiter is going to flip. Wow. Alright. So uh, I yeah. yeah descend upon the Sinful. You definitely yeah. need that. Like right yeah, now. I don't think... <laughs> 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 yeah, but oh, I don't think he can... S- can he survive this turn? No, if he tap, uh, yeah, yeah, he has shambling van to block. He's got yeah, shambling vans. He can block the uh, Tyler's tracker, which will give him uh two points of life. So even with the the entire team swings, uh, Joshin goes down to six. Uh, he can also block with um the knight token. Yeah, assuming so that Tamio tap the knight token, that will leave and only one blocker, right. and the blocker will go towards Tyler's tracker, and that will gain two life. So you need get the reflector mage damage, and mm-hmm. so you at most take seven damage from. Three from the howler and four, uh, th- three from the numbering four. Also six damage. I mean, there's no way to kill. Joshin you can't. Ki- yeah, you can't kill Joshin right now. Unless Risado has a Dromoka command. Then yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, if yeah. Risado had a Dromoka command, like the we, game is we over. Don't have to yeah, that's the only way. 
So oh, no. last one, wow. Okay, last one. very greedy play here. Um, and I want more value. Yep. He's going to try to ulti Tamiyo. <laughs> Alright, so he's going to swing in with... I think you can swing in with all three creatures. Nah, there's okay. no point attacking with the Phantom Mage. He's... If Joshin, yeah, it bounce off the uh shambling vent, so yeah, it just end up with Joshin being a two life higher instead. True, yeah, you won't lose the um the shambling vents. So yeah, swinging in with the three three and the five four. Uh, of course, you know Joshin has to take yeah. some action here. Just take three points of damage. It's okay. Yeah. I don't, I don't know what Joshin is looking for in his deck. He, he might have bot wipes. He needs the he needs a bot wipe. Like he needs uh Ooh, I know like what will be oh. Yeah, Imraku. <laughs> 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 Imraku probably like <laughs> the, uh Tamiyo no do you want LT? No freeze on creature. Nah, freeze also does nothing. Though. Yeah. Well, Bunt, Bunt isn't exactly busted, but it's it's pretty good against the black white control, especially if you yeah. have like a nut. Draw. Bunt is is quite this it's very decent against control that because you have cards like spell color and you oppose ball, you have a lot of counter magic and you also have Tamil. Yeah, which you've got, yeah, you know you've got Tyler's trackers to just you know yeah. boost up your. Uh, yeah, and you can see the power of Tamil quite potent in this. Yeah, yeah he drew Risado at least eight cards. I believe, yeah, probably six to eight cards. Rizaldo, when the value, the value. value. Now with oh, two the different place. planeswalker on the battlefield, I don't think Joshin has any way of winning anymore. Yeah, this yeah. Is there are no planar outbursts in this format. <laughs> there's planar uh, man, but yeah, nobody. Yeah, there's no planar outbursts. Right? Planar outbursts is very good if if you play in a ram deck, a green white ram deck, probably mm. like the those. The one that's recently like in the modern uh, the the green white throne if you can plan out our oh, yeah, yeah. yeah you can plan out uh, and you can then plan out boss into Imaku. <laughs> who, who can win? Yeah, yeah okay, who can cool. win? Yeah. Uh so yeah, Rizaldo taking game number one. Uh yeah, Joshin not I won't say Joshin not drawing very well, but Rizaldo had a very good starting hand and definitely just kept up the pressure. He played yeah, very yeah. he played very well. Uh, you know, just dropping uh, one, you know, dropping one piece by one piece by one piece, so that uh, Joshin has to answer these, mm. uh, you know, these yeah. threats. Joshin didn't have fragile at the start. It, yeah. Yeah. As a matter yeah, of fact, did. despite the fact that Risaro is the aggressive deck in this form, in this uh matchup, Joshin didn't have any way to force Risaro to commit more into the board, which. Right. And it doesn't allow the language to catch many creatures. Yeah, uh, only that one turn where well, I thought Joshin had it, but then you know after that like the, yeah, the yeah. game went, the game spiral went to uh, Rizaldo's. Yeah, uh, because of the fact that the Tamio make an appearance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And also, uh, Joshin didn't really have anything going on. Yeah, yeah. The duo planeswalker of Liana and Gideon couldn't hold uh, much against the. Uh, Star Striker and what's it called? Like uh, uh, Tamio, yeah. Tamiyo, yeah. These two combination really allow Risaru to draw too many cards. Too many cards. Yeah. Too many cards. It's good. Uh, yeah. Not busted, but yeah, it's true. good. I think Joshi needs the boring cards like maybe like Karitas or some form of pressure because the fact that Risaru will boy more Tamios, maybe more Tamios, more Color more Magic. Tamios, yeah. yeah. You can't really rely on the fact that. You you can't really become a more powerful control that because Risaldo is only buying like cards like Nikes, invasive surgery or whatsoever. That's right. Yeah, uh, even ever seen. Yeah. You know, I. Uh, it's uh, I think yeah, uh, Joshin has a quite an uphill battle. You yeah. Know, he, he, you don't have as many discard spells mm -hmm. against uh this deck. I mean, you can take out let's say some of the negates so that your languishes will resolve, but even then. Uh, Rizaldo has uh, spell quellers and mm, uh, true, true. You yeah. know, to, to take a out a lot of tempo spell, a lot of flyers or so that like yeah. I ever see in spell queller selfless spirit so far we have not seen a selfless spirit yet no? yeah oh no, yeah, yeah, not, yeah, yeah that's right Rizaldo yeah, might be that. running the the full werewolf package the uh, a werewolf the yeah. four lambhole pacifist and, and the uh, four uh, Dasho Shikuta Dasho Shikuta yeah yeah so, Alright, uh, if you're just joining us, you are watching the SCG Game Night here at Grey Ogre Games. It's round three. My name is Mick. I'm one of your hosts alongside Mr. Two for Jeffrey Chan. Yeah. 
Your name has come up a lot in Channel Fireball over the last two or three months. It's the it's the bot that, right. that like me It's the bot that like me. Every time they search, every time they search, it just my name pop up. Yeah. It's a five zero. You're yeah. going five zero in a lot of uh, in a lot of tournaments. So you know, you only see me up. once there. Yeah, then once there they pick me up. You never <laughs> see you never see those those moments the where like, the, those instances where I'm languishing like two three or whatever. Zero three. Yeah, and then when I try a certain that. I'm like, hmm, this is that five zero. Wow, very impressive. Then after that, I won't, I cannot replicate the result anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, but what deck hard. are you playing right now? You're playing the uh, Kitty pack, uh, but now okay. I'm more focused on the Zendika draft. I'm trying to uh, open more okay. more fetch then. Yeah. Yesterday I was oh, double queuing. Yeah. The the Zen Zen movie. There's a there's a flashback. Oh, yeah. Okay. Zendika. There's a all right. That's yeah. Cool. I how do how do those Q drafts go though? I I never got to play too much uh, Zenika Warwick uh, drafts. Zenika like. Warwick is a very aggressive format because of the fact that land four and yeah, there is cards like like Step journey and it's like ally mechanics also. The ally mechanics oh, yeah, is pretty yeah. insane. When if you get the insane ally that you really like, you start going off. Just yeah, get, get a, a lot like, of three color, yeah. two color, three color ally deck. Two color, three color. Ally deck. I I, tr- I play a four color ally deck. Now I have like three of the dual land. Now I just in keep. draft. Yeah, in draft. Holy four color. smokes! I think my deck is like at least the creatures are most ninety percent ally. Only like reckless scholar and some some other creature are not ally. The rest is ally. So uh, every wow. every card I cast, is, yeah, is getting triggers, more and more triggered. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm guessing it's white based, yeah. white or green based, right? Because yeah. uh, of the uh, yeah, of course the fixing those and the goals and plus one plus one counter. So uh, yeah, yeah. Those are good. I think yeah, the, but I the one playing, uh, more successful uh, one I think is I I I play a deck with Monoid though. Monoid deck is quite insane. Monoid, yeah, yeah Monoid. In Zendika, you there's cards but like you the have spy, guy, the, right, no, no, no Goblin guy. You have cards like the the Zendika Shrine Expedition, which you got three oh points yeah, counter against the ball one, lightning, yeah. right? You get ball lightning. Now I have the somebody pass me the red, the elemental appeal, which is form on a, another ball lightning. <laughs> yeah. Oh then yeah. I have <laughs> like the spiral brush, so which deal damage equal to the, the number, number of mountain in your deck. Oh yeah. Yeah. Also, I crawl <laughs> back. Get plus one plus zero first try. Uh, plus one plus zero equal to the number of mountain you control. Mountain you control. Yeah. Oh, that is. What wow, has yeah. insane, man? Yeah. Partly because I first two pick uh plated GOP. <laughs> okay, that's yeah. The GOP is insane. Yeah, the plated GOP is. I remember my friend having a um having a landfall deck, uh back in the day like that standard. Yeah, yeah. That the, standard the, the standard. Wow, standard. that was good. That deck was like brutal. Yeah, I think I won one the PDQ or. I can't remember what it's pretty cute with the boss that now I lend the deck to Mark then Mark made like I think Sammy before he made a mistake with the sideboard then mistake. he died yeah the deck is really insane I mean you, the card the deck the format was there was so much mistake too so yeah, you can yeah, really yeah, look for I equipment remember, yeah. and then yeah your deck is like insanely fast you have cards like uh, Stablings PJP Goblin Guy and you have like Burns and, yeah, and so there's puff decks. Eh? There's the puff decks. There was no, no, there's blaze. no puff. There was searing blaze. There was uh Yeah, yeah, searing that? blaze. Man. I remember I sort of remember that, but I played more uh ROE. I didn't get to draft too much uh Zendika. Yeah, when I, did, I came back yeah. it was like on the when uh, ROE was coming out. Yeah, when 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 the transition from Zendika work to ROE the uh, the national that the year nationals I uh, I was like horribly <laughs> <laughs> get red. Yeah, get red. When my draft I see my red both of which is an artifact red and I like, no I'm dead already. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The, tri- the the fact that it was a triple hour I can't even get myself out of the the ditch because it's just so bad. The deck is just so bad. And I promptly went to zero three my draft. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no no. Oh yeah, zero three, zero three. That nice. the third loss was because I had deadly error. Then the match I was oh, about man. to win, I got deadly error. Then I like, ah, damn it, man, Josh, why why now? <laughs> Uh, all right, so going back to, back the, to game, the game. Uh, this is turn four, and Rizaldo going to duress, taking out clash yeah, of wills. Sorry, Joshin going to duress. Yeah, taking out clash of wills, and uh, just going to pass the turn, uh, making sure that you know the um, dust watch recruiter doesn't yeah. flip. You know, once it flips, like that's going to be a bit of uh, trouble for Joshin. I don't. Okay, in this control match, every time when I'm maybe like playing a control deck, we are facing off the dust watch recruiter. Uh, in the early turns, I don't really be affected by the fact that if uh, recruiter flip or doesn't flip. 
because the recruiter is one of the lousier creature in the early turns anyway. Yeah, and if right. you flip, you're playing a control deck. If he ever going to drop everything on the board without a selfless spirit, there's very easily to wipe out everything. And even even yeah. with a selfless spirit, yeah. like, you're even going to just... Spirit, if, you have a, if you are a black deck, you have a languisher, languisher so you can yeah, wipe exactly. out the whole board. So it, that really doesn't put a lot of pressure that I, I'm... We prompted to use a bare premium mover on a uh, dust rusher scooter. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Spell queller there going to probably eat up. Yep, eat up the uh, ruinous path. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, the yeah. more Rizaldo commits to the board, the more Joshin yeah. is uh, smiling in his heart. Like yeah, yeah. I think Joshin is s silently s trying to set up the language. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, Rizaldo is going to cast Nisa. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Okay. So. I mean, I don't think. Uh, it's not. If it's if, not if I would wrong. me, I would. I won't play it though. No, yeah, it's it's, it's a two mana. Yeah, it's, it's a two mana Nisa. Mana. It's just two mana. Ah, yes, okay. it's two mana Nisa. Uh, so you can actually cast more things, but no, don't don't do that. That's a that's, yeah. that's not a good idea. Unless uh, unless this, this is yeah, unless the another spell card you drew and another spell card that's insane. This would be. Actually, yeah. very good. So you just lay the forest and just yeah. pass the turn. Uh, but if Joshin has uh, maybe another remover, maybe like even a duress to check clear the hand. If Risado has a negate, I uh, know Risado gonna oh, lay the okay, land. He's gonna lay a uh, land, uh, so he doesn't have the spell yeah. color, which means that you know Joshin is free to go, just wipe out the board. You would be wasting your ruinous path. But that's okay. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, you got three creatures yeah. for the price of one. Ha 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 ha. Tornado. I definitely have a very strong feeling that Joshin has a white as a sweeper in the form of language in his hand. The fact that he did not choose to use Runia's Path on the turn where the recruiter was being cast. Was yeah, and allowed the spell card to eat the Runia's Path. Signify that he has a language in his hand. Come on. Language. Language. Yes, he has a language. Fire. Language. Yeah. Boom. Entire. Yep. Thing goes. Um, I have no idea why Rizardo chose to cast the Nisa that turned. Yeah. The uh, ball was no. quite impressive enough that, yeah. No, but he right now he can cast the uh, Sivar Vukit. Yeah, but Sivar Vukit wasn't going to die to the... That's true, yeah. yeah. He can choose to cast a Sivar Vukit and Nisa and next turn. Nisa this turn, right? Yeah. Wow. Alright, so fully commit to the board. Limbala? Yes, a Limbala. Yes, those Limbala are so good now. Well, Risado needs to draw. Gain 5 life, he's got 3 3. Yeah. Got that five, five, you use the yeah, recruiter to, to get find enough. Yeah. Damage, yeah. With a damage, Nisa will work also. Nisa mm. will give you some advantage. Tamiyo will be excellent. Oh Ta man, Tamiyo yeah. right now will be so sick. Uh, he's gonna look for things. Yeah, spell counter will work to another seven. Okay, will help. Ever since will also be fantastic oh, now. <laughs> ever since yeah, ever since okay yeah. Like, I don't There's a lot of very good stuff for Rizardo to have in now. Like, tire striker, seven advocate, right. ever since. Alright, so there you we go. Ever since, yeah. that's good. Uh. Not gonna be in. Uh, I don't think it's uh, it's important to be in. If Risado has another land, then probably he can lay the land and keep up the dash of Peter. Well, he does right, not. Maybe so I think he has a spell color in hand then. Yeah, yeah that's, that's one of the that's, that's one of the main yeah. reason why you chose not to activate the, the recruiter that's again. Recruiter in response to the flip. All right, so transgress the mind here is just going to take away the uh, counter magic. Does he have the counter magic? No. Okay. Oh yeah, no, he has the counter magic. He does, but yeah. it's not going to be. It's not going to help. Uh, unfortunately, he didn't keep the. We might have just drew the Clash of Wheels. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. He, did. he, did. he leaked through the... I mean, the Limbala was... Yeah, was cast after the... Uh, cast the, after the... Fight, after right? the... After Risaro MD is in. Mm. So let's see. Is that a... Uh, the Bunker's Command? Nope. Wow. Do you just he minus... So, do you just yeah, definitely minus... Just Emblem. Bye then you can, bye, you can, you can start... Going towards the face. Yeah, beat, Unfortunately, beat. I don't think there's a Gideon emblem there. <laughs> no, oh, no, there, there is. There is. There is. There I is. know because I went through the box uh, at the beginning of the night uh. looking for octopus. Oh, octopus. Because octopus <laughs> sure have one. Sure have. Sure have one. Because I planted it there a very long time ago already. Crush of yeah. tentacles. Crush of tentacles. Yes, a crush. But now crush does not see much play anymore. Oh man, I'm gonna yeah. make a. I'm gonna make a comeback uh, for crush. True, true. <laughs> 
Uh, so uh, uh, you have to wait until the credit company to face out. Though. I believe that a lot of the origin cards very uh and the DDK cards suppress a lot of the That's true. powerful cards from off of Game Watch or some other forces. That's true. Yeah. Uh so yeah, Joshin here taking a butt ton of damage, took ten. Uh just gonna pass the turn. So I'm pretty sure Joshin has some removal. Some. Uh but that's you know, does it hold up to a clash of wills though? Yeah, Ultimate Prize will help though. Oh. No, no, everything's okay. Yeah. Somebody was just too strong on the table. Ah. I need to I want to make a rig to uh to have overhead, overhead, yeah, 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 overhead yeah. Yeah. Uh so that we consistently get the same video every time. <laughs> uh rather than me having to go and like adjust the camera. Yeah, you, 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 you having being the rig. <laughs> yeah, me, <laughs> me. You are the rigger now. Me. Make the rig. Make the rig. Uh, right. So. Wow. If Joshi has a removal. Does he yeah. Have a removal? Anguish I'm making. making. Okay, so. Yeah. That's going to. And that will prompt a clash of will from Rizaldo. Yeah. Clash. Four. Four. Five, for four. Yes. X is four. Okay. But that means. Dash. That also means that Rizaldo doesn't have any other shenanigans. Uh, but Joshi is going to go down to 3 which is not a position that he wants to be in he has Blighted Fan which will help take out the Howler though I wouldn't if Joshi would attack again then uh, but if Risado would attack again Joshi would probably activate the Shambling Van and then and double, double block, block the, uh, the if no he can't even take out the same advocate because same advocate is a 5-6 five, 5-6 six. Five, six. oh yeah yeah Omnisys wow oh, okay. of course but you can also do that Game five no, more. No, there's no there's no there's no more injure. Yeah, we only put one injure in the No, because the board is two 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 different creatures. I mean two to two. Oh okay. <laughs> oh yeah yeah yeah, he doesn't get an injure. Right, right, right. <laughs> two two. Yep. Sad face. That's why you only put one injure. <laughs> <laughs> Sad face. Because it's Sad face. very hard for Limbara to trigger twice. <laughs> for both of his effects. Hey, you never know, man. Let's yeah, we never know. We never know. Never know. Yeah. Uh, all right. So Rizaldo here just needs like a a blink. Wow. wow. Why are you so good at the game, see, man? Tamio, Tamio I see. Kills. Tamio, come out. <laughs> uh, and exact is for eight points of damage with a summary dismissal still in hand. Congratulations, Rizaldo, for taking yeah doing LSV style. <laughs> uh, LSV put it in the sideboard. LSV made the mistake of yeah, 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 the yeah, sideboard. Yeah. It should be in yeah. the game board. It's a good card. Yeah, the style, luck, skill, victory. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Alright, so thanks for tuning in For the SCG game night We're going to wrap up um, So yeah, remember if you like what you watch uh, mm. You can catch us on Wednesday night as well Where we do our modern, modern. Sometimes on the weekend We have tournaments like this weekend Yes, we have the modern, PPTQ, modern. It's on of Saturday or so? 4th of September 4th of September uh, It's a Sunday 4th of September it's, it's a Sunday this Sunday, Sunday yes. from uh, 1 p.m. Singapore time onwards we'll be uh, we'll be showing that and uh, yep. yeah, if you like to get your modern fix uh, this yes. yeah all the, the WMCQ is coming are, too the, yep. yeah the WMCQ coming on next week next next week yes next next week next 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 week next next week and uh, recently okay. just to notify one of our Singaporean won the GP Guangzhou yeah, yeah with um, Delver Albert so Desmond. yeah Alberto's law. Don't say Delver cannot win GP anymore. Yeah. <laughs> well, he comes here. He comes here quite often, yeah. right? Like yeah, when there's like a more modern event, probably we can see him in the modern PDQ too. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, piloting his awesome, awesome deck. Yeah, he used to play like Tron deck or other as like other control deck. So yeah, Delver. Delver is a big switch for him. Yeah, yeah big switch. I mean. But that one is still a semi control deck. It's a tempo deck, it's, yeah. It's a tempo deck, right? yeah. yeah. It requires a different. Mm. I mm. actually think it requires a very different skill set. Yeah, it requires a very, very specific skill set and requires a lot of experience. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's true. Uh, so, yeah, join us then for those uh, those streams. So yep. Sunday, we'll see you on Sunday. Sunday. And uh, yeah, remember you can uh, catch us, just you know, follow our Facebook page. Follow yeah. our YouTube page. If you want to see me play, yeah, YouTube yeah. used to play. Go. And, uh, used to go. 
Yeah, just follow our Twitch channel. Last but not least, uh, do pay our partners a little visit. Their Power Nine podcast. Yeah. Every week, myself and Alfian, we get together and we just uh, talk shop about Magic the Gathering, MTG yeah. lifestyle style. You can always check their YouTube channel too. Yeah. They also have. But we don't have hundred followers. Please, please not subscribe yet. to not our yet. channel. Then we can change it to just youtubecom podcast. Easier. Easier for for saying stuff. <laughs> anyway, uh, thanks for joining us. We uh, we're glad that you're here with us. You could have been anywhere else on the internet tonight, or uh, also on Modo, <laughs> because Modo is up. Wednesday night, you're forced yeah, to watch Wednesday us night, because yeah, Wednesday night. Modo is down. But yeah, uh, thanks for joining us. We'll see you guys next time. In fact, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah. Yep. All right. So for myself and uh, Jeffrey, we're signing off. Ciao. Bye.